old Nokia, even during its Lumia phase, was perhaps notorious for all the sorts of color options and combination it made available. Some of them were nice to look at, others were pretty garish. I'm still not sure where this new Nokia 8 variant falls in that spectrum, but it can be best described as unique. With only two weeks left before its expected unveiling, the Nokia 8 leaks out again, this time in a somewhat never before seen copper gold color. We've already seen the Nokia 8 in gold, it in fact looked more like orange gold. That however has nothing on this new leak, it's called copper gold supposedly and it's not a shade we're familiar with. Perhaps there's a reason why no one has thought of it before. If Nokia and HMD were aiming for a shock factor to sell this Nokia 8, they might very well be successful. If they're planning on aesthetic appeal, we'll have to wait and see it in the real world first. That said, the Nokia 8 is not at the cutting edge of style of fashion. They don't rely on edge to edge screens, curved glass or minimalized bezels. By going for the finished simplicity of a more straightforward design and more off the shell components that are manufactured in much larger quantities, HMD's handset have some margin to play with in terms of pricing. And that could be where the Nokia 8 handsets has an advantage over the competition the price. The Nokia 8 is expected to ship with a Snapdragon 835, 64 gigs of storage with microSD expansion and a dual camera system from Zeiss. That's a pretty attractive package that compares favorably with high-end handsets like the iPhone 7 or Galaxy S8 and puts the Nokia 8 squarely in same territory as high-spec handsets such as the OnePlus 5. There are rumors that it will be priced around $600. If true, the Nokia 8 will be a powerful device at an attractive price. Also, HMD gained 500 of Nokia's design patents that were previously owned by Microsoft. Trademarks such as PureView, Clear Black, and Pure Motion still belongs to Microsoft, but there's a possibility that they may be transferred as well. However, one of the design patents acquired by HMD is for the Lumia camera UI. The UI was introduced with the Nokia Lumia 1020 and offers easy access to camera controls like ISO, focus, exposure, and more. None of the new Nokia smartphones launched by HMD feature a decent camera UI, so the new patent should come in handy. That said, the Nokia 8 is expected to launch in August the 16th and more details will appear in the meantime. So subscribe for all the latest coverage and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Было намного лучше, но на этот раз как-то не удалось. Во-первых, народы мама, музыка не очень. А что за направление? А? Что за направление? Направление? Какое направление? Что за направление музыки?